Hey there, welcome back and thanks for joining me. All my supplies and equipment are down in the description box and most of them have links so you can check that out. And if you like this video, hit that subscribe button. If you wanna be notified of future videos, hit that notification bell. So I have already started, I got excited, and already started mixing up my paint. So I I'm, I'm think I'm gonna do a flip cup so I've already got black, brown, and white in here, and I'm just kind of continuing to layer that in. And so this is what I did. Whoops, I got a black, okay. Uh, so I'm just doing black, brown, or black, white, brown, white, black, white, brown, white. So I wanna have, make sure I have plenty in here because I do not wanna end up short. See that? That's pretty. Okay, so here, I think that is gonna be enough. I'm chicken, I wanna do some more. Let me just do that. If I end up with a lot of drip off, I'll do magnets, how about that? All right, so here we go. Now, this is a previously done uh, canvas. I played, didn't like it, so I've painted like a, it's a light gray over it, but it doesn't matter because this is going on top of it. I'll let that sit for just a little. Let that paint work down. I have been wanting to try a black and brown and white for the longest, and I end up grabbing the blues and purples and greens and all the fun colors. So today, I am doing this. Now, my mixture is, in each of these cups, is 40 grams of Floetrol, 20 grams of color, and 10 grams of water. Sometimes that water, depending on the thickness of the paint, will go to 20 grams. And the paints that I am using, I've gotten this from Hobby Lobby. The Master's Touch, it's acrylic. Wait till they go on sale, they're like five bucks for that. And then for my black, I use this, uh, what is it, Annie's? I can't, uh, it's got a thing over it. Oh, rust -oleum. interesting. So I use this one for my black. I play a lot, so I, I go for economic uh, paint. <laughs> All right. This is the part that nerves me out. Okay, um, slide a little bit. Wow, wow. Holy cow. If I just had that in a picture, I'd be happy. That is so pretty. Grief, that's pretty. Okay. <laughs> keep that up. Too bad we can't keep those. All right. Whew. I start stretching this out. I'm afraid I don't have enough paint. I'll be honest. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to do another one right here. I don't think I did enough. So there's some white. Here's my black. And if I have to mix up more, I will just do it off camera. Because I'm going to need some more. Some white and brown. Yeah, I'm going to mix some more up, so I will be right back. 
Okay, I am going to mix this in case you're new. If you're not, you don't need this. Speed ahead. But in case you do need this, this is an idea. So let me get this off of pounds. Pound grams, there we go. So this is how I do it. Uh, put your container on, hit your restart or your uh, clearing button. And because I'm probably going to do more stuff, I'm going to go ahead and mix up. I want to take that out. Um, a full a full thing again. So I'm just going to do 40. And hit your clear button again. Go back to zero. It's the easiest thing. And we'll do 20. I'm just going to do about 10. I didn't hit the reset button, so I'll just go to 30. And there you go. So take that and mix that up. Now what I do sometimes too, though, is I have these waiting for what I have left over in my cups. All right, let's continue with what we're doing. So let me put some white in here. And I'm gonna put some more black. And you know, this is kind of funny. I wanted white between those. Um, in my head, I wanted to try double. So this is my double. There we go. All right, I think I will end up with a white. So, this is gonna be different. <laughs> I can't pick this up, so it's just gonna have to go plop and hope for the best. Jeez, um, hmm, one, two, three, no. <clears throat> okay, oh, there we go. I just can see this flying everywhere. Good grief, I love these colors. Everything I've been doing here this past week and a half has been fall colors. I think I'm wanting fall, and here it is, 1st of July, 5th of July. So I'm wanting fall, apparently, because my in alcohol ink, I've done all fall flowers. All right, I'm gonna pull this, I don't know which way I'm gonna take it. I can take it that way, I can take it this way, or I can take it, oh, I don't want to do it through there. You know, it's probably not going to matter. Good golly, that is gorgeous. Full cup, future reference, full cup. Okay, let's start.
This one wears me out at running off the sides. I know it needs to, but I just see paint going off. My goodness, how pretty is all that? Okay. Well, my day's good. This is all I do today. My word. Oh. Yeah, this one may not make it to the selling wall. This may not make it. Oh, gosh. Love it. Ah, I love it. Yeah, in the salon, I have a wall I put my stuff up on just for my fun, and it's interesting. People come in going, so I need a birthday gift, and I'm thinking, wow. So my fun stuff started selling, and, and I'm, I'm, that makes me a little nervous. Um, not my comfort zone, but holy cow. Ooh, this is so, so pretty. Wow. Okay, I'm going to... Bring you down a little closer. I don't know how well you'll be able to see this stuff, but All right, let me torch it first. Let me get some of this done before I forget. Now I want to do a black and white one. Jeez. Holy cow. Awesome. Okay. Let me get up here. I have to get on the stool to get my camera. All right. Oh, my word. Look at some of that. This turned out so much better than I thought. I am so excited. I can't wait to get some epoxy on this. All right. I so, so appreciate you joining me. I hope <laughs> this brought at least a small smile to your face today. And gee, go out and try something like this. This is awesome. It just looks like earth or something. Wow. All right. I appreciate it. Thanks for watching, and y'all go have fun.